Welcome back to Is It Playable? In this video we'll be taking a look at whether Castlevania Lament of Innocence is playable with PCSX2 within RetroArch. Hopefully it's better than uh, Curse of Darkness. Sad about that one to be honest, because it plays fine, it just... the textures did not want to cooperate. Yeah, it did the same thing as before though. Just with several pop-ups, all happening in quick succession, not knowing what the hell they said. Alright, moment of truth. Actually, moment of truth will come in the next 30 seconds or so. Maybe. I, I, uh, and P. Oh, crap. The hell was that? There we go. I, I don't know what I just did. Something popped up. I thought it was going to be like new game. All right, moment of truth. Is this one playable? Or more so, more playable than the first one? Or the last one? Perhaps. Oh, wow. Okay. I can't control the camera. That's weird. This is a good sign, though. I mean, with the other one, it was... Texas were flickering all over the bloody spot. Not... not so with this. Interesting. I was about to say, my only hope is that I'm going the right way. Uh, is that prelude to the Dark Abyss? Oh. <laughs> Wait, how do I go through? Triangle? What the hell? What a weird button. Triangle is my interaction. Alright. I mean, this is infinitely more playable than the first one. Oh. Marker stone. I can't tell if the textures here are screwed. No, I think this boss will look like that. I keep using the right stick to pan the camera, but it's used for something entirely different. Oh, nice. Head for the exit. Serum. Oh, am I supposed to like... no. I thought maybe I could use triangle to pull myself up. Head for the exit. I really maybe should have seen what it mentioned. No, I could just use that as a thing. I don't know what it told me. Oops. I would head for the exit if I could make it. Ah, oh, that I can throw. Okay, I can throw stuff. I keep forgetting. Down brings up items. Up brings up items. Oh. Hearts. I'm so confused. I'm not sure. I'm just gonna leave. I'm gonna say it should have let me, so it's fine. The more areas I can go to, the better I will feel. It can give me a good, um... I keep pressing the wrong button. Give me a good benchmark as to whether or not textures are gonna screw up or not. Do -do 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 -do. It's weird that the triangle button's the interact button, when it also does a bunch of other stuff. I suppose you couldn't have made it circle, considering circles how you throw knives. Well. Oh. Ah, oh, this is a save point. Well, shoot. Which means the only way I can go is in the place that I can't get to. Oops. Maybe I should have paid attention to the tutorial. <laughs> Oh well. I wonder if there's a way of actually seeing that. Encyclopedia. There we go. That's not a good sign now, is it? Skill list. Also not a good a good thing. Orb list, relic list, equip list, item list. There's a lot of stuff. 
Also, is his face all jacked up? No, I think it's his, uh... I think it's his hair covering his... face. Sub-weapon, jump, attack. Attack big. Oh, what a goofy... S Just what a goofy, uh, word. Instead of heavy and light attack, they have big and small. So I can't interact with that. No. Oh. I mean, if I can't get up, then, you know, so be it. This'll just be where the test ends, sadly, because I'm too stupid to figure it out. Is that what I'm, I'm... maybe I just wasn't jumping correctly? Although I don't actually know if they even had something I could grapple onto. Grab onto. No, they don't. Now yeah, I am too stupid to figure it out. Well, shoot. I thought maybe you'd be able to use this as like a... a pulley? Oh, you can. That's what you're supposed to do. Okay. I figured it out. Look, no, I, re I remember seeing the like preview image and it showed him using the whip. But, you know, I didn't realise I could actually use it like that because I skipped over all the messages. It's my own fault. Well, there we go. I can leave now. Yay! I am glad I went the other way, though. Because we got to see another corridor. Finally, enemies! This is weird. It's like a more traditional Castlevania, I guess. It's like you have the heart system to be able to use items. Quick step. Guard button and X. Ah, I can dodge. I also found 25 bucks. Making a bunch of money from skeletons. They have a lot of money. That's your place you can traverse by hooking... Oh. Yep. Oh, what? Oh, right. I see. I just saw a face. So I didn't know where the hell it was. That's pretty cool. Yeah, the traversal's pretty decent. A magical ticket. If you guard against enemy special attack. Oh. Nice. Oh. Well, there we go, we got him. Get. <laughs> I don't know why he shrunk. Nice. Oh, I should probably deactivate. Cool. I set myself on fire. I keep throwing knives. Oh, I am so. Oh, right, we're back here now. I guess. Yeah, I don't know why I keep thinking that circles the interact button. Well, that's never the case. Unless it's a Japanese game. Or oh, Xenosaga. Xenosaga is one of the only... One of the only English games that has a Japanese button layout. In terms of, like, X is back, circle is confirm. It's very strange. I think I'll do for a test. I know most of it was spent running around trying to figure out what I was supposed to do. If only I read. But never mind. But yeah, it seems that... um. Castlevania Lament of Innocence is playable. And that's going to be the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you have enjoyed. If you did, please like the video, subscribe for more, leave suggestions for games you want to see, and until next time, take care.